Dashboard lights can be confusing and worrisome. There's so many of them. What do they all mean? Don't worry, they are not all bad. We made this video to help you understand the meaning. How do warning lights work? When you start your car, you will notice the lights on the dash come on altogether. This is to check that all the bulbs and connected components are working as they should. These should turn off after a few seconds, but if one or more stay illuminated, it is to warn of potential problem. Warning lights can also come on whilst driving. If this happens, depending on the color and icon displayed, you may have to pull over and investigate at your first safe opportunity to do so. A red warning light demands immediate attention, don't drive any further. A yellow orange warning lights indicate a problem that needs to be serviced soon. Engine coolant warning light. Coolant fluid absorbs the heat from your engine and disperses it through the radiator to prevent your engine from overheating. This yellow warning light will come on when coolant levels are running low, to remind you to top them up. Avoid making any long journeys without enough coolant. You should stop and top up as soon as possible, otherwise you risk causing serious damage to your car. Wait for the engine to cool down before topping up. If this light comes on often, get your car serviced to check there isn't a leak somewhere. Engine coolant temperature warning light. This light will come on when the engine is overheating. This could mean that coolant levels are running low, perhaps due to a leak in the system or it could be a sign of a larger problem, like a head gasket failure. If this light is red, you should stop straight away. Without enough coolant, your engine could get so hot that it effectively welds itself together, causing irreparable damage. Stop and wait until the engine has cooled off before checking the gauge on the side of the coolant tank under the bonnet, topping up as required. Read our guide to checking your engine coolant. While you're under the bonnet, have a look to see if there are any obvious leaks. If you can't see any and the light goes off after topping up, then you should be fine to continue your journey. If the light comes back on again after topping up, you should get it checked out to fix the underlying problem. Thanks for watching, and subscribe for more. If you find this video useful, please share it with your friends, and if you have any questions, leave a comment we'll respond.